Hello, and welcome to Death of Raven Gaming, where it's week two of opening a case of Crucible of War. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have that much more to say, but let's just start digging in immediately, because I think that will be fun. So let's just get this one open. Once again, we're trying to look for those legendaries, obviously. A fable wouldn't hurt, but mostly I just want some more majestic uh, equipment that I need. Uh, so yeah, let's just jump into it immediately. If you haven't seen last week's video, it's gonna be uh, uh, be linked in the description, so you can watch. And then, so yeah, let's just start going immediately. Comments, comments, comments. Uh, ooh, foil, red scenery forces. That's gorgeous and foil, and just a towering titan and a scepter needle. Let's actually remove the foils. I didn't do that last time, but let's remove the foils. If you can hear weird scratches in my cat trying to get into the room, but uh, she's just gonna be on the table, so let's not do that, you know? Um, yeah. There we go. Ooh, this is Jesus Mark. I'm just gonna do it. I like, I really, really like the, to um, sneak up on the symbol, first of all. That was unfortunate. There we go. And as I said last week, I'm sorry for the weird lighting on my face. I don't have... I'm trying to focus on doing the lighting on the cards first. Um, so yeah. I'm gonna get better at it. Maybe not in this series, but after that. Let's see what else. Leaf type. Leaf. Bravo. Rousing either. And then an Absorption Dome. Spoiler, but... First Majestic. One, I also don't have three. Oh. So yeah, if you haven't seen it last week, I just said that uh, we're opening it. Wow, the light boxes doesn't want to stay in, their sp in its place to the now. But yeah, no, so I, I'm opening Crucible of War, because that's the, the set I have least cards in. And I'm not opening a case in a video, because I'm saving money for Dynasty, so that would just be one video, and uh, I'm trying to do some more content. I'm gonna start doing some gameplay. Uh, actually, planned now. I have planned some gameplay, so uh, can't wait for that for that to get out. So yeah. Ooh, whirling mist blossom in foil. It's gorgeous. And then a rock slide trap and dungeon press. But yeah, so. <sighs> Let's see here. Let's do the research notes. Not any other. Focus on workshop. Why don't anything wants? I apologize. That's just the me. Why doesn't anything want to stay? Let's just put it there now. Yeah, maybe it wants to work. Stay there. Uh, Miss Blossom. Oops. Put four. Turn to tempo. Blessing of Serenity. In the foil. Then just a reinforced lines and towering titan. Combustible Courier. Yeah. Foil Rune Chant is fun, and then a tripwire trap at Russian River. Nope, you're going up there. <laughs> but yeah, I said, like, I'm not. Right, it's gonna happen after Nationals that I do gameplay. That's the plan. Because uh, I'm just now, I'm just focusing so much on uh, Nationals. Um. I'm practicing my Icelander deck for that, and I'm putting so much focus on actually learning the matchups and everything, so that's why I can't really... Uh, I can do multiple things at the same time, but I'm just gonna not focus as much as I want to. Uh, so yeah, we'll see how it goes in Nationals. I'm probably gonna do a deck tech video after, and, um, and say how it went, like, and after... After the nationals, it's after nationals in Sweden is so promise of plenty and foil. Sigh and modern skies. It's twenty fourth. It's the nationals in Sweden. I'm gonna travel about five hours for that. It's worth it, but we'll see how it goes. We have some really really good players in Sweden, so I don't have too high hopes. Um, 
this guy since I'm doing Forsyth, but I'm gonna try at least my the hardest, the best I can. I'm not the best player, but I'm learning. Push forward, foil, frog beak. Where are those majestics? It's also super funny. I'm looking for a KO <laughs> card because I apparently don't own the hero for some reason. Dominance. Ooh, a foil beast within. I actually only own two, I think. So that's great. And then the reinforced line and crane dance. Speaking about KO. <laughs> Not that he usually likes that card, but it's at least a brute card. That's gorgeous in foil, actually. I mean, the foiling in this game in general is just on another level. I'm actually going to just move how I sit, because it's awkward. So now, I s now it looks better, yeah. Let's see here. But yeah, no, I'm looking forward to see how the... Ooh, oh, that's foil. Rattlebones is a nice card as well. Also don't have four, uh, three of that one, so that's great. I totally forgot that I was doing this. Um... Oh, right, that was Majestic, right? Yeah, it was. It was the... It was the... Beast within. The Rattle Blast. But yeah, no, I... Uh, I don't even know what I said. Let's open the next one. Uh, I can't wait to see how Meta is now. After Prism's gone. A lot of Guardians are going to come back pretty hard. Which, sadly, I think makes it that... Uh, Draw my can't really get in there. Oh, a foil Cavdean. And there we have our first majestic uh, equipment. One I don't have. And I'm collecting for uh, a deck for Dash. So that's great. The AB2 on that one is uh, scary. Like, anything that has an AB2 equipment is just good. It's just so strong. Um, rattled up, crane dance. Yeah, because um, what I've noticed when I play Slander is all the on-hit effects is on 3 or 5 usually damage. And most characters can't get to 5 Arcane Barrier. Dash can pretty easily go to 5. I mean, with equipment, obviously, but uh, she doesn't usually want to. But, you know. It is what it is. Got a quick research note. Some Marvel and Skies and Promise of Plenty. I definitely think uh, Runeblade is getting hype now. I mean, obviously, we've seen Briar in uh, in Lille. Just went crazy. And uh, Viscera, I've seen so much Viscera right now as well. Uh, which is weird, because I... Personally, so far with my training, I'm having trouble figuring out the Islander versus Briar matchup. But on the other hand, I'm having a pretty easy time with Viserai matchup for Islander. I played in the Lille against uh, Viserai, who played very, very well. But I think I, I think I used my Waning Moon six or seven times that game just for free, just because I blocked arcane damage. Oh. Um. I would have liked another <laughs> another majestic equipment, but that is a foil one. So that's of course taking a place in the collection instead of the regular one. But I wouldn't have mind pulling two different ones. But you know, it is what it is. <laughs> that's pretty fun. That's pretty funny. Uh, it reminds me of when we were in Lille, uh, Fluke, and. Uh, Fabled Hunter and another one I can't remember the name of, whose actually video it was, opened up first edition um, Arcane Rising and the first edition Crucible of War. And in like p car uh, packs back to back, they opened a. Uh, uh, what's it called? Crush, crushing Fist? Crippling? No. The, the Fist for Guardian, anyway. And he opened a normal one, and then a almost a pack after it was a Cold Foil one. Uh, obviously, this is not a cold foil. I can't afford a 
first edition box yet at least. Uh, Choke slam. Ooh, magnetic shockwave. So I noticed this is a this is a dash box. Uh, it's a dash box. It's <laughs> two regular majestic and two of the same equipment majestic and dash. It's a dash box. Good to know. Still haven't seen that uh, KO, <laughs> which is only a rare, but you know, I have two more boxes after this to to find it in. Cash in foil, a dauntless and barraging big barraging. Is it a big? Yeah, it's a bit big horn. Let's see here if I can open something else. And I said, I think it was last week, when, when it comes to legendaries, of course, I hope for a tunic, because everyone hopes for a tunic. But I already own a tunic, so I kind of want Chiana. I don't own a Chiana. And I think Chiana is pretty cool. Especially now when she's gotten her first living legend uh, points. I think Chiana is really, really cool. And I wanted to try her for a while. So, yeah. I'm just going to speed up, because... Uh, I see my battery on my uh, camera is getting low. So a snapback foil, a lot of fours, and we have three packs left. Okay. Blessing of Rarity, Russian River Reinforced Line. Let's let's see here the last two packs. Consuming violation. Ooh. Coax. Ah yes. <laughs> uh, Coax a commotion is great. Super happy to see that. But uh, what I'm more happy about is to get the bloody KO that I need. Uh <laughs> I, I I'm work I, I've been playing around with KO and um and uh, Walda, and that's why I really want to open a uh, crater. Crater Fist is his name, because I actually don't have one. Um, but yeah, KO, that's great. I'm super happy to see that. Lunging press, last pack, nothing. Dauntless and high speed impact, and that was the the box. We have two foiled majestics. And then one, two, three, four, five, six normal ones. And I know last week we had uh, we had six normal ones, but only one foil uh, majestic. So that's a uh, another majestic. Uh, so yeah, but thank you all so much for watching this, and I'll see you next week when we open another box. Thank you so much, and have an amazing, amazing week.